Seeing that the old man surnamed Du looked at him recklessly, Yang Kai was not surprised but rejoiced, his left eye suddenly became as deep as the sea, and the golden pupil appeared. Life's Exterminator Demon Eye The pure golden pupils are narrow and long, making people daunting, and there is no idea of resistance. It seems that this eye has become the master of the world. And on this golden pupil, there is still some inexplicable glow lingering. Colored Glass Divine Light After refining the colored glass beads that Dai Yuan gave to him, it fused with a little power, although the colored glass divine light had not yet fully blended with the life's exterminator demon eye, Yang Kai could already use its power. The life's exterminator demon eye is the innate divine ability of the great demon god. It is not acquired through hard cultivation, but is inherently possessed. It will increase in power as the person who owns it grows. So don't look at the great demon god until death is only a saint king, but this life's exterminator demon I were in Yanka's hands, and it could continue to exert even more powerful power. An invisible vortex faintly appeared in the golden pupil, and from that vortex came a strong suction, and the old man's surname Du was shocked. At this moment, he actually felt that his soul was turbulent, and he couldn't help but give birth to a kind of the illusion of being sucked away. This discovery made him look horrified, and quickly ran the culture technique silently, suppressing the throbbing and panic in his heart. But this is not over yet, and the inexplicable glow lingering near the golden pupils gave birth to a weird power at this time. Under the influence of that power, the old man's surname Du surprisingly found that the newly stable divine soul was turbulent again, not only that, this time even his body seemed to be a little out of control. The life's exterminator demon eye had the effect of devouring the essence of the martial artist's soul. Yang Kai relied on it to perceive the martial arts of heaven beyond his own realm in advance, so no matter how fast he was promoted, there would be no flaws in his state of mind. The disadvantage of unstable mood will not occur. And colored class divine light has the power of restraining the body and soul, conquering the five elements. Even with the two mixed Qi elements, it is not to be underestimated. However, Yanka's current strength is not high, the higher the level the more effective it is. But the effect will be reduced when dealing with the strong man such as old man Du, not to mention that the old man surnamed Du has been demonized at this moment, and it is more difficult to deal with than the ordinary second order void return stage. So just a short breath. The old man with the surname Du got rid of the dual deterrence of the life's exterminator demon eye and colored glass divine light. But it was enough. During this time, Jiang Kai had already shot a dozen space blades with his fingers and attacked the old man named Du, after his eyes were clear and his body was free again. That pitch black blade-like attack just hit the front. The old man surnamed Du burst into scream, roared, and two layers of light flashed on his body. Stacked together, it looks very thick. The two layers of light barrier, one layer is condensed by his own pure Saint Chi, and the other layer is transformed by the monster Chi of the blue-eyed blood toad. But the two layers of protection can't stop the cutting of space blade. Silently, more than a dozen spatial blades flashed past where he stood, and after cutting through his body, he flew again several tens of feet away before gradually disappearing. But the old man with the surname Du stood there in shock, looking at Yang Kai in horror. Immediately, he lowered his head and looked at his body. Only saw a lot of blade-shaped holes in his body. Through those holes, he clearly saw his broken organs, squirming six internal organs, and red blood flowing out of those incisions like a fountain. The Power of Space Force The old man surnamed Du murmured, his body clattered. It broke apart and turned into a pool of minced meat. On the old man's face the two eyes were round, and it seemed that he could not believe that he was planted in this place until he died. Looking at his body, Yang Kai let out a sigh of relief. This battle was really not easy. Even though Yang Yan was able to suppress the opponent's strength by presiding over the formation, after using the demonization secret technique this old guy could also perform far beyond the usual level. 
If it weren't for a lot of means, he might not be able to kill him. Suction came from the life's exterminator demon eye, swallowing the soul of the old man named Du. This is the soul of a cultivator in the void return stage, which is of great help to Yonkai's insight into the power of understanding, and he will naturally not miss it. After this battle, Yonkai has some vague judgments about his combat effectiveness. At the current level, there is no problem with confronting the second order void return stage martial artist but whether he can kill depends on the opponent's ability. As for the third order void return stage, it seems to be a little reluctant but without a real fight, Jiankai is not good at making judgments. On the other side, without the spiritual mind control of the old man surnamed Du, the black python transformed by his one-handed axe secret treasure also showed its original shape and fell to the ground. With a move, Yonkai first retracted the purple shield, then picked up the one-handed axe and played with it, and threw it into the space ring. Standing in place and investigating in silence for a while, Yonkai quickly understood the situation in Dragon Cave Mountain now. Basically all the intruders were killed. Somewhere more than a dozen miles away, there was another enemy in the void return stage that was caught in a hard fight, while his opponents were three void return stage. From the aura of these people, Jiang Kai quickly judged that the enemy should be a strong man of demon blood temple. Needless to say, the three void return stages are obviously Chang Chi, Haowen and Ning Shangqin. Although the realm of the three was lower, there was no problem dealing with the middle-aged man besieging the demon blood temple in Dragon Cave Mountain. Yang Kai felt that the situation was also one-sided, and the enemy would lose and die sooner or later. Ning Shangchen would wade in the muddy water this time, and he was standing on the side of Dragon Cave Mountain, but it was beyond Yang Kai's expectation. After all, he didn't have much friendship with this senior. He just talked a few times in the Emperor Garden and his party. Although he knew that his intention to make friends with himself was to borrow the fiery bird item spirit, Yang Kai was not disgusted. The other party doesn't have the slightest malice, he was just asking for something, and in the end he readily agreed to his request. The unintentional act at that time brought a reinforcement to Dragon Cave Mountain at this time, which was unintentional. Otherwise, Chang Chi and Hao in alone would be unable to kill the enemy of the Demon Blood Temple. Of course, whether there is an Ning Shangchen in Dragon Cave Mountain or not the mountain would be harmless, but this discovery made Yang Kai happy. No longer paying attention to that side, Yang Kai cast his gaze to another place, a cold smile appeared at the corner of his mouth, and immediately strolled towards that side. In that weird world without sun, moon and stars, Zhi Li sat cross-legged on the ground, his expression unwavering, he had tried for a long time, but he still couldn't break the formation in front of him. He was very decisive at this moment, knowing relying on his own abilities, he can't break the formation, simply no longer waste time, but recharge his energy and wait for work. He knew that the Phantom Array had no lethality, and if the enemy really wanted to kill himself the enemy would always show himself. As the strongest of the Zhi family, Zhi Li's temperament is indeed good, but the Saint Kings who are next to him are not so determined. At this moment, they all look at Zhi Li eagerly, hoping that he can tell there is a clear way out. But Zhi Li remained silent, and they were helpless, let alone daring to ask questions. Everyone is like ants on a hot pot, anxious. Suddenly, Zhi Li who was sitting cross-legged stood up, his eyes exploded with shocking light, and he stared in front of him not far away. When he got up, the void in front suddenly fluctuated with a layer of ripples, and immediately a figure passed through there strangely as if through a transparent curtain of water, and easily came to the front of the Zhi family. Looking at this person's face, Zhi Li's eyes narrowed with a killing intent. Of course he recognizes Yang Kai. After all, his son Zhi Hongwen was killed in Yang Kai's hands. The murder of his son, Zhi Li always want to repay him, but he is also a man who knows of a hardship and he did not rashly came to Dragon Cave Mountain to find Yang Kai's for revenge. After all, there was a Jian Tong behind Yang Kai at the time. Even if he succeeded, he would have to be buried with him. If this were the case, it would not be worth it. So he has been patient, always looking for opportunities. 
Fortunately, after failing and finally waited until today, now that they meet with the enemy, they are naturally extremely afraid. But Ji Li was still able to hold his breath and stay calm, just staring at Yang Kai firmly, and did not rush to make a move. Breaking into this illusion, Yang Kai glanced at it and indifferently called out the fiery bird item spirit. The fiery bird spread its wings, and the large fireball smashed at those few Saint King Realm cultivators. These poor Saint King Realm martial artists have been trapped for so long, and they have long been upset and attacked by the fiery bird item spirit whose strength is comparable to the powerhouse of Void Return stage. How can there be any room for resistance? The defensive artifact sacrificed in a hurry could not withstand the fierce attacks of those fireballs. They broke apart in the heat and impact and turned into pieces. The bodyguards on their bodies also flashed wildly, and they were broken in the blink of an eye. Screaming for help and fell to the ground and was burned to ashes. In an instant, several Saint King Realm martial artists were all killed, and no resistance was exerted. But Ji Li didn't change his face, as if it wasn't his family's disciple who had died, just staring at Yang Kai coldly. After a long while, he took a deep breath and said solemnly, This is the first time you and the old man have met? Old man Ji Li, presumably you are no stranger. Yang Kai picked up the corner of his mouth and said lightly, I know you are Ji Li, and I also know why you are here, but I just want to ask one question. Yes, before dying, the old man can satisfy your wish. Ji Li snorted coldly, seeming to be quite confident in his methods. Boasting shamelessly. Yang Kai grinned, forget it, I don't care about this with you, you just need to tell me where Lu Yi is and I will give you a whole body. Lu Yi? Ji Li frowned. It seemed that he didn't expect that at this time, Yang Kai asked this question, but a strange complex expression flashed in his eyes. He immediately shook his head and said, I don't know, probably dead. Dead. Yang Kai does not believe it. Lu Yi couldn't die so easily. He had cut off one of his arms in the flowing flame sand field. But even so, his arm grew back again. This made Yang Kai unable to understand. To be continued.